Naturalist from Dominey State Beach checking in again. Hope you're having a good day. Oh, I thought maybe what I would do, instead of talking about beach trash and doing arts and crafts, I would share a little story with you. As you can see, sitting next to one of my little buddies over here, and if you remember last time, he's probably one of my favorite critters that swims in the ocean. And in my book, he's probably one of the best surfers in the ocean, along with the dolphins. But for today, I'm going to share a little story with you. In the Out of the Visitor Center in Blue Erie Open, we have a lot of books if you'd like to come back and perhaps buy like some of your money that you're earning while you're at home. All right, so here we go. Pit Kahuna. Can you hear me okay? Can you see me okay? I'm just making sure. All right, Pit Kahuna. It was a Saturday. Fergus and his baby brother, Dink, were collecting treasures. Any of you have a baby brother or baby sister? The waves would roll in, leave something for their collection, and then roll back out again. It worked quite nicely, as long as Fergus didn't have to go in the water. Man, I wonder why he didn't want to go in the water. He knew there was more than just treasure in that water. Oh, I wonder if he was a little afraid of something. There was a murky, murky ickiness. Oh, I wonder what he means by that. What do you think? Oh, there we go. So far that day, Fergus and Deke had collected some seaweed. A lot of seaweed, especially during the summer at Dobie. A pebble that looked like an eyeball. Oh, look at that, looks funny. And a shell that might be an actual shark's tooth. Oh, I wonder what that looked like. And then, does that look like it rolled in? Anybody know? They waited. 15 whole minutes, but nobody claimed, came to claim the surfboard. So they decided to make it the star of their collection. Of course, surfing on it was way out of the question because of the lurky, murky, ickiness factor of the water. So what do you see them doing? Oh, here they go. So they found other, drier uses for it. And they named it Dave. Dave was a loyal companion. Stay, good boy. They're using it as like a little table. After a while, Fergus offered to get some ice cream. Chunky chocolate chatajonga. Choo choo choo. Right, Geek? <laughs> that sounds pretty good, huh? I don't mind a little peanut butter in there, though. Dink looked long and hard at Dave. Oh, look at his face. He seemed to have lost his shine. You must miss the ocean, huh, big fella? You should be wild and free. What do you think he's going to do with that, Dave? Relaxed on the surfboard. No sooner had the words left Fergie's mouth than he felt Dave rise up beneath him. Uh oh, what do you think's happening? <laughs> oh my goodness gracious, cowabunga! <laughs> Each other. I served. Fergus and Dink kept their eyes peeled for more treasures. 
And boy, did they find one. Anybody know what that's called when they're surfing together? It's called tandem because there's two of them. All right, well, what do you think? Did you enjoy that? And as you might know, people go surfing here at Doheny all year round, especially during the summer, Cowabunga, that's when the waves are big, when the south swells come in. All right, well, it's nice getting together with you again, and I look forward to seeing you next time. Happy trails.